What's going on guys? Drew Greco here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're out on the beach doing a little flounder fishing using a bucktail and a teaser rig. We're looking for some keeper flounder. The goal for today is to catch a limit of fluke, three fluke at 18 inches. So hopefully we can make it happen. Um, it's like my third time here this year. Every time I've been here, I got a lot of shorts, so hopefully that changes today. There's a lot of bait in the water. There's a little, there's fish on the intro. Seems tiny. Yep, a little short. Real tiny guy. Nice little flounder. As I was saying, there's a there's a lot of little bait in the water, and then some some snapper blues chewing on them. So hopefully there's some big fluke around eating the scraps or something. But we'll see what happens. And just pound bottom. Hopefully weed through these shorts for some keepers. Little guy. A little short fluke. Nice little fish, but he's not going to cut it. Choosing a three quarter ounce bucktail. Pound in the bottom. Seven foot six, medium fast rod, three eighths to three quarter ounce. Oh, I just got it again. Tied up the teaser. Fish. Little guy. Real small. On the teaser rig. Sometimes they just want it a little off the bottom. How's it going? How you doing? Good, how are you? Alright, anything biting? Uh, a couple of fluke. You got your fishing license? Yeah, I should have it on me. Nothing big enough to keep? Nah, uh, just shorts. Shit, this is my New York one. I do have a jersey one. I registered. Okay. I, I just don't have it with me. Uh, make sure you carry it with you, okay? Okay. Oh I'm sorry about that, officer. Have a good day.
fish. Pretty good. Nice fluke. I'm a teaser. Get a measurement on it. Just to get a gauge. Chunky little fish. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Had an awesome time out there catching some fluke. We'll end up getting stopped by the cops. Um, if there's one thing you take away from this video is to always try and have your license on you when you're fishing. Whether you got a screenshot or actual the paper form. The paper form is really what they want, but if you have a screenshot, something to show them, they'll usually let you go, but I usually have mine with me at all times. I have my New York license in my uh, surf bag because I was fishing in New York two days prior. I just forgot to switch it out, but shout out to that cop for letting me go. He could have easily gave me a ticket for not having a license, but he was a nice guy and let me go. So, can't complain about that. Other than that, guys, if you're enjoying these videos, please make sure to give them a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below, and I'll see you in the next one.